uh, to Dr. Apurva Gupta, I bring in all the wishes and greetings from Speed Medical Institute on behalf of all the faculty members for scoring a topmost rank in any SS 2022 and an AIMS rank number uh, 5 and CML rank number 12 uh, in specialty of MCH pediatric surgery. Congratulations to you. So can we know a brief background of Dr. Mm -hmm. Apurva? I mean, from where he started his MBBS till date? So, uh, sir, uh, I've done my MBBS from uh, MJMS Vardha. And uh, I've done my post-graduation also from MJMS Vardha. And uh, after that, uh, after that, I've done my one, one year of SRship in Vardha that was a bond itself. And currently, I was working as an SR in Southern Jung Hospital in General Surgery Department, Delhi. Okay, okay. Why your special interest towards pediatric surgery? Sir, actually, uh, initially I was preparing for gastro surgery, to be frank. But uh, I, I do, because of my family situation, I was not able to prepare. In fact, I didn't give any tests 2021. I was, after, I had some things which were pending in my family, which, uh, which were making a uh, hindrance towards my preparation. So after that, when I, when I finished everything, then I started preparing for knee tests after buying you, after, after uh, taking your app and speed app, because I had, Heard a lot of times that it is an it is an old and gold app. Always follow speed app, and uh, but I had never followed it <laughs> because I have not given PG entrance. I got PG uh, on my marks basis of MBBS entrance only. We were internal candidates of MJMS that was a Central Government College. We got PG on. We were the last batch who got PG on our own marks, and after that we we never prepared. Uh, and uh, in fact, I had not uh, gone through whole of surgery also during my MS also because. We go into gastro surgery and we keep on reading GI surgery and that, that was my inclination. But since it was a, a rural college, we didn't have different specialty departments. We used to get pediatric patients also. So my aim was to be a general surgeon if I'm not going to be a GI surgeon at least. At least. So that was that is why I thought that I'll either prepare for GI surgery or pediatric surgery. I have, was not exposed to neurosurgery at all. I was not exposed to CTS at all. So I thought at least I'll be a surgeon and I'll be operating upon pediatric gastro surgery, pediatric urology. In that way, I had made my thought process and that way, that is how I prepared. And uh, uh, I just, uh, I think uh, this was the first time I got interacted with Speed App. And uh, two, two to three months back, I had bought it. Uh, exam forms came out. My wife, me and wife, uh, wife discussed about this uh, topic, whether what top, what subject we should put in for AIMS. And uh, she said that uh, since NEET SS date are still not declared, you put in your full uh, efforts for uh, AIMS and that to pediatric surgery. And I have just read only the only entire uh, content which was given under the pediatric surgery column of Speed App. I have not read any books. I have only read thrice speed app pediatric surgery lectures in a month in a month and <laughs> probably these are the results sir. <laughs> <laughs> very simple and straightforward answer <laughs> hmm. and uh, and how uh, you prepared for last one month is that what one and a half months, one and a half months. Not probably not. i was preparing for neat ss <laughs> i was preparing for neat ss through speed app only and uh, uh, to be specifying about speed app, I was initially face facing problems because I felt that uh, question answer format probably is not helping me. But mm -hmm. when in middle of the middle of the uh, lectures, you used to tell no, you should follow like this, you should follow like that. Then that is how I thought that probably this uh, way of teaching is helping me complete my baby book. <laughs> that came in next 15 days over time of 15 days. And in the meanwhile, AIMS form came up, came out examination forms. And then I moved specifically towards uh, pediatric surgery column, which was in the app only. And that is how, sir, it has all helped me out. See, what I, what I have learned is, and I also teach students is, talk in the language of exam. That's something called, uh, talk in the language of exam whenever you talk. Yes. And if you are uh, creating a content, or uh, teaching someone, the language has to be exactly the language of the exam. Yes, sir. What happens at times, uh, faculty himself has his own storyline of the subject, his way of understanding of the subject. That will be more attractive and easy to understand because he will put that format in a way that you can easily understand. And because he has understood that way. But that storyline is not the storyline of the exam. So the storyline of the exam is from the Bailey, Subistan, and Schwartz. 
So we have to go to those storyline and they don't ask theory there. It is not a theory exam. It is an MCQ exam. Yes. And when that is an exam, so it's better the entire book and the content of that book is discussed in the same format. Yes. So that was, that was the whole idea of uh, making uh, that presentation. And, uh, reason i would just like to say sir that I, I, the reason behind i was not able to get through neat is because i have never read bailey in my ms days i have read the entire suggestion and the basic junk chunk of questions which now come nowadays come in neat is is from bailey so there are very small small points which now which i realized when i started reading your app that questions probably can be picked up from here questions can be probably can be picked up from here you need to understand the uh, terminologies they they might be asking this and this used used to tell us in between that this question was not framed for you to uh, just read that topic it was framed to make you, you aware that the question can be made from here also so it's basically to trick you trick you <laughs> so how many tricks and how many uh, things we can make the student to fall in the trap and answer wrongly yes sir yes so sir. that's all right great now what will be your uh, message and advice to juniors who want to prepare for pediatric surgery um, it's 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 a very simple advice sir i i prepared from speed app i have not uh, read anything any book uh, whatever i had read in semester and very obviously that i have read from my very i read this time and uh, uh, I, what I was lacking in this time in pediatric surgery, probably I was not aware that so many general surgery questions will be there, and that is because of reason. Uh, when I gave uh, uh, AIMS SS exam one one and a half years back, that time in GI surgery probably there were so not so many general general surgery questions. The content of general surgery questions have increased. Probably there were around thirty thirty five questions in general surgery which I was not aware, and every third fourth question was on trauma. So the only thing is was before preparing for pediatric surgery, I was going through your trauma trauma topic only. So that is how I got help from everywhere. Okay. <laughs> so, so I would only suggest everyone to, uh, as you yourself say, that uh, no one has, needs to read any book. If someone follows Speed app uh, thoroughly, probably the the content is so much elaborated from everywhere. If someone blindly even follows Speed app, probably he'll get to any any damn specialty of his choice. Really great doctor. And uh, where are you right now? I mean, which city or in uh, in Varda? Since I'm I'm working in uh, uh, Sabdajang Hospital, but uh, okay, yeah, you said Sabdajang. Yeah, you have come to Sabdajang. But I'm staying right now in Gurugram, sir. Okay, so uh, I mean, uh, when to join? Which date is the uh, date to join? Probably in prospectus. It's given in first of July. Okay, so it's a great time, great time uh, ahead until you join. And such an wonderful time that what you wanted to do, and I wish you all the best and all the success as a as a future a great pediatric surgeon in the years to come. And we'll be looking upon to you and advance sure. to you. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you.